Yo guys, welcome back to another video. I know I've been inactive a bit, but I'm back now. And today, I'm going to be talking about the C100 E2. I know a lot of you have been asking me in my DMs, Solomon, what bike is that? Solomon, did you paint it? What bars are they? What are In this video here, I'm going to be answering all your questions. So let's stop talking and get straight into the video. Guys, the first thing we're gonna start with is the color. Now, this color is a bit of a purple. People think it's purple, some people think it's blue. It's more of a purple. On the website, I'm gonna show you guys right now. On the website, it says it's purple. It actually does look purple. I like this one better. Just look at the color, look at the bottom as well. Yeah, so that's the first thing the color of the bike. Let's get into the next one. Oliver, how are you going? So guys, but first, before I continue, let me tell you guys something. This C100, it's not the normal C100. There's upgraded parts in it, stuff has changed. It's not just one of a different colour. You've got new headset. You've got new forks. Track and forks That what? What's that? Lock and open. So you've got the new, you've got the new forks that lock and open. You've got a new headset. Bars. Now these bars, yeah, they're collective bars, guys, as you can see. And we've got a collective step. This is all new. This is all new. Sadly, the collective pedals, the one-way quarry pedals, don't come with it. And the collective little hand sheet doesn't come with it. But this and this come with the pro. So if you guys get a pro, you're gonna be having rock shocks, you're gonna have the LH sheet, you're gonna have quarry pedals, it comes in a whole package that like, is your set because it is a video, yeah? Yeah. Look at it. Yeah. Double check. <laughs> Now these bars are the new collective bars. As you can see, they're not like every bar. It says the collective there and there. That's it on this side because our collective family were different. We don't do the same thing as other people. So we're gonna change it up a little bit. Same as the collective stem. As you see, try coming. Look at that top cap. You guys tell me if you've seen this top cap anywhere else. You ever seen this stem anywhere else? No, okay. So let's get on to the next thing. So guys, basically, one thing that you guys probably don't know is the brakes that it comes with. It does sound it doesn't come with this brake, but this brake comes with the Pro. But I'll show you guys literally right now the brakes that this bike comes with. It's not a normal Shimano, it's an upgraded one. It's pretty sure it's a long lever Shimano Dior. You're gonna see a picture of it right now. And yeah, so those are the brakes that literally come with the bike. So the bikes have a lot of upgrades to it. You've got the brakes that are different, bars that are different, stem that's different. Forks, lockout. If you've noticed, there's a change. There's a change to the frame. Can you guys see this? Get that bit there. See how that was big. Let's walk over to trash chat. As you can see on Chad's old rusty bike, rusty. <laughs> his is different. All right. Now I'm pretty sure on that bike, the headset is tapered. But it's not a problem because it comes with those forks and it comes with an adapter. So you're all good, you don't need to worry about certain forks or whatever. Because these forks here are not tapered, but on the Pro, it comes with tapered rock shocks. It's just, the Pro is just a full package, literally. But this bike is nice and it is very smooth. The people that I've let ride it, they've all said, yo, Solomon, this bike is so smooth. So yeah, literally, it's a it's an upgraded C100, the normal one. This is just the smooth. So yeah. But I'm gonna get a couple clips. I'm gonna show you guys what it is like to ride this bike. I'm gonna slap in a couple old clips as well so you guys can actually see. So let's stop the talking and get into the riding clips. <laughs> 